Jesus came to set people free. Yet you can read in the Bible that there was a people who wanted a king over them because every other country had kings. They wanted to be like every other country. They thought it looked good or they just wanted to be like everybody else. God didn't want to put a, a head over them because God set them free. So they would be free just having God above their head. But you know, the people wanted it and they got it. So that proves that God doesn't force you to walk the right path. You may choose the wrong path leading to destruction. Jesus came to set you free, but you wanted a king. And look today where the kings are sitting in the countries. What are the kings doing? Are the kings really doing what a true king should do? What did Jesus show you what a king does? You call him king of kings. What did Jesus do? And what does the kings of this world do? The same thing, you have put yourself in a snare when you go around calling yourself Christians. I have warned you so many times about it, because Christian means Christ-like. The least Christ-like person ever in the whole Bible told you to call yourself Christians and you believed it. Well, I come and witness about the truth and tell you clearly, clear logic and you don't hear me. That means that you're not of the truth and you are not Christian. You are not Christ-like if you don't hear what I'm saying. And the next thing they did was putting a head above you. That all of Christians should have like, oh, we need a priest, a head priest, a pope. Oh, let's call him, call him a pope. And you chose a country to be the head over you. A, a, and a pope that men votes forward. God didn't choose pope. Did you really think that God chose the pope to be head over you? With their hats, all their hats. Didn't you learn in school that those with hats, you know, when someone did something bad and, you know, the teacher wanted to make them look, how do you say, you know, shame them a bit. They were given a, this like big, big, uh, tall cone hat to put on their head and then stand in the corner looking into the wall. <laughs> <laughs> Let those who have eyes see. Let those who have ears hear. But if you call yourself Christians, Catholic, or whatever you call yourself, and think that you're supposed to have the Pope or a king above you, you are greatly mistaken and you should repent or you will perish, I warned you. 